The Lagos State Government have been called upon to enforce a total ban on the operations of Okada in the state. Stakeholders made this call during a forum with the theme, Okada Ban, What Next?, held in Ikeja, Lagos. Plus, the Vice Correspondent, Love Ikukoye Doku, reports that the stakeholders also called for extension of enforcement timeline of a total ban. Her report. It was truly a time of stock taking and appraisal of successes since action on Okada Ban took effect in Lagos State. In June this year, the Lagos State Government banned commercial motorcycle operations in six council areas of the state. Three months after, what's next? What's the true situation? When you look at the six local government and nine LCDs, um, the accident rate has reduced by 86% or, or thereabout. Crime rate has also reduced drastically. And uh, you would find out that in those local government areas, people are beginning to walk, people are beginning to enjoy, you know, like um, their leisures, um, etc. And um, other local government are clamoring for the same uh, ban. Speakers at the forum suggested that a ban should be extended to other parts of the state for protection of lives and property. While lamenting how the carelessness, modus operandi of the operators have led to losses of lives, injuries and irreparable damages, they lamented how the operations have constituted means of illegal migration and a facilitator of crimes. For the stakeholders, a total ban of operations of Okada in all local government areas and local council development areas in the state would be most welcome. As we did a total ban on the operations of Okada, not only in these six, LC, six LDs and nine LCDs, but throughout the 20 LDs and 37 LCDs. Because like I always tell people, why you have a responsibility to earn a living? Government also has a responsibility to ensure that you have a decent, li decent living. You don't have a right because you want to earn a living to go and commit suicide or to put people's lives at risk. We need to continue to enforce this ban. And I've not been, I've never supported the Canada uh, uh, operation. And I will never support. I can tell you that once upon a time, they came to me, that I'm back, I said, for you. Speaking, the State Commissioner for Information and Strategy, Benga Omotosho, said the stakeholders' meeting was significant to get feedbacks from Lagosians. You can see Lagosians are calling for a total ban on Okada, not just because of all the dangers that Okada constitutes, uh, the breaking of heads the smashing of uh, limbs, and all manner of uh, things that uh, are bad, that people have uh, 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 attached to Okada. But they feel that because of the security implications of uh, having Okada flying all around the place, that the state government must do something about it. He said the resolutions will be presented to the governor for firm decision in the best interest of Lagosians, having satisfied the demands of democracy and transparency through critical engagement. From Lagos, Love Ikuku Uyudoku, Plus TV News. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.